from New York. Charlotte, North Carolina. Akron, Ohio. Alexandria, Virginia. I live in D.C., but I'm a Palestinian American. Seattle, from Peru. Ann Arbor, Michigan. Here in D.C. Uh, Spartanburg, South Carolina. UNC Chapel Hill, North Carolina. Ethiopia. I'm from Washington, D.C. I'm from Baltimore, Maryland. From Chicago. From Washington, D.C., a high school teacher here. From Maryland. I'm from Ethiopia. I'm from uh, Silver Spring, Maryland. And I live in Northern Virginia. From Baltimore, Maryland. Also from Baltimore, Maryland. I'm from Sudan. We traveled from Baltimore to Washington, D.C. in support of the Palestinian people. children dying, with families dying, with like almost half a million people displaced. I think that we all have to share our voice because injustice anywhere is justice everywhere and it's just I stand in support of human rights. There was this mother who had a child and the mother died in a bombing and the child died because Israel cut off the power in the hospital and it's just really sad knowing that a little baby didn't get to live Live his life and grow up and see the world. Innocent children that's been been bombed, the hospitals, the schools, the markets have been bombed, and nothing's been done for it. What happened to them is not fair, you know, it's against humanity. No podemos eh, ser indiferentes al drama del pueblo palestino. Lo que los israelíes hacen es un genocidio. I'm out here as a veteran because uh, I've had this government lie to me too much. This government lied to me in 2003 when they sent us to war, and they're lying now about uh, the U.S. funded war on Gaza. Most of the stuff on the news is bullshit, and people take it for fact, and it's not. So those who do look out and look for it can find what's really going on. I feel like a lot of people just don't know what's going on. They're ignorant. That's not their fault, but we're here today to make sure that they know. This has been going on for 66 years, an illegal occupation and oppression of an entire people. A lot of people are realizing that we need to, you know, have a strong movement to resist the best thing that we can do here in the United States for the people of Palestine is to show our solidarity. And the easiest way to show your solidarity is really to bring down the system of colonial occupation, which the head of which rests here in the United States. money and weapons to Israel. Mr. not sending our arms paid for by my tax money, which I do not authorize to be used to be killing people. President Obama, you, you're digging a big hole for yourself, you know, and you have, you have choices to make. As an African American, you're embarrassing yourself because you forget where you came from. You know, like I said earlier, man, like we know where we came from, we know we went through the dirt and the ground through the 1960s and 70s and being oppressed and getting treated like second-class citizens. The same thing's happening in Palestine. And for you to turn your back on them is to spit in the face of people who came before you and put you on the back. There it is. Stop the killing, stop the war! 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 I'm happy to see all these people, not just Palestinians, but um, people from all around the world coming out to support Palestine. Everybody in different countries, in Peru, in Bolivia, uh, have even the governments have uh, joined to condemn this massacre. It's amazing and I hope more come and this is to show and it's not all Muslim people. It's people from all around the world, from all, it's humanity, it's not about religion. It's great, you know, that people from all over can come together. You know, for one cause. <laughs> I think it's really inspiring to see like people of all different races, creeds. I'm so proud of everybody, especially the people from Chicago, people from Delaware, from Florida, from Baltimore. Thank you for coming. I think that this right here is a starting point, it's not the ending point. We need to keep this up as long as we can, you know. Um, but it's a beautiful sight. I, I'm praying that it keeps going.